Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Coach Jimmy Inman coming at you from Hubie Gallagher uh, Gymnasium. Uh, we've got some prep playoff basketball action. 5A, 20 seed Fountain Blue visiting the 13 seed Covington Lady Lions. Should be a good one. You have entered the prep zone. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. We're here with Coach Chris Bove of the Covington High Lady Lions. Uh, Coach, excellent season. Congratulations on all the accomplishments so far. Getting to see Fountain Blue again, uh, the question becomes, is the focus going to be on uh, you know, execution, or is there going to be a strategy change? Uh, how are your girls handling this, and well, what do we have to look forward to? You know, this is a new season. District's over. Uh, preseason's over. Tournament play's over. This is a new season, and this season is going to go five, five games at the max. So tonight, it's all out, everything you got, no matter what, no excuses. And uh, this, this group of girls, uh, they know a lot about Fountain Blue. Fountain Blue knows a lot about us. Fountain Blue's a well-coached team. They play hard, they're, they're scrappy. Uh, we know our hands are full tonight, but uh, we're not gonna look ahead. We're gonna take care of the business tonight. Outstanding, Coach. Well, uh, could you give us some of your players to look out for? Who, uh, who might be worth eyeballing, so to speak? Uh, you know, we got, we got balance in our team. We've got, you know, our point guard is Meta Lombard. Our, our off guard is Kiara Brown. Our, our center is uh, Coco McDowell. Her sister, Tasia McDowell, is the long, long arms and long legs out there. And then you got uh, one of our senior leaders, Taylor Singletary. And the neat thing about our team is you might stop one, but you can't stop them all, and they can all hurt you. Hi there. We're with uh, Coach Mark Beeson, Found Blue Lady Bulldogs. First of all, Coach, Congratulations on an excellent season. Uh, I know that you've seen Covington a couple of times. Uh, the question then becomes the familiarity. Is it something where you're going to focus on uh, strategy or just doing things very well this time around? Well, in a lot of ways, it's a blessing to, to play somebody close to home and that you know, but in some ways, it's a curse. You got to, you know, you know each other really well, so. If you really are a pretty good chess player, you can lay out a decent strategy. It's a little harder if you play somebody further away that doesn't get to see as much. But it's also, you know, kind of a pain to get film and work out stuff on short notice. But we've seen Covington plenty of times. A lot of these girls played against each other for two and three years now. So this is going to be a matter of who makes the fewest mistakes, who's focused the most, uh, and who, who does a yeoman's job on defense. Defense wins these games. If our kids can guard and get a hand up and rebound the ball, we stand a real good chance. But so does their team. So we got to hope we can put out a better effort. Coach, could you uh, fill us in on a couple of your players to uh, keep an eye on? Uh, some, something the folks at home might want to focus in on. Well, number 23, Jacqueline Chauvin, is our, is our best player. She's our bread and butter. Uh, she's signed with, with Southeastern Louisiana. She's been uh, kind of the cornerstone of this program for the last four years. Uh, her sister, Jenna, uh, number 20, and Raina Torregano, number 14. Those are the girls that uh, they usually do the, the, you know, the, the lion's share of the work for us. All right, ladies and gentlemen, 5A playoff basketball. Found blue in the red kit. Covington in the home white, blue shorts. Two teams with a lot of success on the season. Each one piling up 21 wins along the way. District mates, district rivals. A lot of respect between the young ladies and the coaching staffs. Got the tip. Found blue controls. Tom Blue, really sharp team in terms of ball movement, lots of quality. They can definitely stroke the twine from the outside. Putting the ball in, back out. Drive the baseline, looks inside. Just wide, just wide. Sidney Murren with the shot. Good look though, good look by the Lady Bulldogs. Covington switches the point. Ball stolen. Tom Blue checks up. 
Almost, ball almost fell. Jenna Chauvin. Ball's out of bounds. Be found loose in bounds right here. Got Jenna and Jacqueline Chauvin. They can definitely handle the ball. And we got a kick ball here. It's going to go Fountain Blue's way. Chauvin to Chauvin. Drives, kicks out. Just long. This is Covington's ball. Found Blue looking to press right out of the gate. Pushing numbers into the forecourt. Taylor Singletary on the inbound. Metta Lombard bringing the ball up. Looks to Singletary. She drops it in. Tosh McDowell out. And there it is. Kiara Brown. Three points. It's tray time. Covington now with a little press of their own. Found Blues having a little bit of trouble with it. And 10 seconds. Did not get the ball across uh, midcourt. Be Covington's ball. Inbound, Kier Brown pushes the ball over. Metal Lombard on it. Puts the ball out wide. Little jumper. A little fortuitous uh, moment there for the, the Lady Lions. Found Blue breaks the press. Pushes the ball into the corner. And... Uh, Covington coming away with it. Jacqueline Chauvin not quite able to find the range there for the Lady Bulldogs. Singletary looks out wide. Tasha McDowell back out. Meta Lombard. Covington being a little patient here. Letting the ball do the work before they find their mark. Just off the mark. And uh, not finding their range there. The iron was a little unkind to Kier Brown. Covington on that trip down came up with nothing. Found Blue, bring the ball up. Covington's backed out of the press. Swinging the ball in, drops it in. Back out. Uh, this one's uh, into the bleachers. It'll be Covington's ball. Here Brown into Meta Lombard. Meta to Singletary, back to Meta. She goes for three, not there. Back iron again. Covington gets to the loose ball. And a foul on Covington. Meta Lombard. Lady Dogs bringing the ball in. Looks wide, letting the ball do the work as well. Ball's played out to Chauvin. Back into the hands of Chauvin again. Found Blue showing some patience. Trying to break the seal here. Looking for three off the front rim. Covington chases it down. Good work by Tasha McDowell. 
Singletary, they look to swing. Not there. Well defensed by the Lady Bulldogs. Chauvin probing, looking, deep three. In and out. Covington looking to push here. There's nice hustle right there. Nice hustle by McDowell. Nothing came of it. Found Blue resetting. Chauvin again. She is quality. It's my understanding. She uh, she's in the 2,000 point club. So that is quite impressive. Fountain Blue finds the range. Sydney Murren. Nice, nice little uh, pop and drop right there. Finding the bottom of the basket. Breaking the seal, if you will, for the Lady Bulldogs. 5-2. Covington looking for another three. Not there. Singletary, not there. Another look. Not there. And a foul. Covington showing a little uh, rebounding prowess right there, getting to the ball, getting multiple looks. Put Singletary on the line. Nice rhythm right there. Singletary finds two. One of those senior leaders that uh, Coach Bo Bove pointed out. Tom Blue breaks the press. Sheldon looks to redistribute. Not there. Ball's found. Oh, good hustle back by Sheldon. Tom Blue pressing. Uh, got a foul on the Lions. Lady Lions. Uh, Definitely clogging things up right there. But you got to give all the credit in the world to uh, Ms. Chauvin. Finding a way and making a way. And I tell you what, she's also got a, a great stroke there from the line. Again, these are two quality squads. They, uh, they're battle tested. No surprise uh, that these two found uh, a way to, to meet up and battle to advance in the playoffs. Metal Lombard on the ball. Swinging it out. Singletary's on it. Takes a look. Drops it in. Lombard swinging it again. Back in. Stolen. Pushing the ball. Chauvin, nice. Excellent work by the Lady Bulldogs. Bulldog, Lady Bulldogs took a while to find their rhythm, but uh, since then they've been on a run until Singletary uh, finds the range there from three. That was a big basket. It gives Covington a little bit of breathing room. Tom Blue does a good job swinging the ball. Uh, nice recovery on that side. Chauvin looks to distribute. It's being very patient right here, the Lady Bulldogs. Smart stuff. Shot off the front iron. Good work by, by Murin to get to that ball. Distribute it again. Good work by the, uh, the Lions defense to force up some tough shots, but uh, I tell you, the Lady Bulldogs, they're close. Couple of shots off the front iron. Either one of those could have dropped. That was from deep. First quarter in the books.
Parish Public Schools, an A-rated school district. Graduates with the highest ACT scores in the state. Facilities with the latest technology. Safe and secure schools. A variety of sports. Fine arts. And learning to last a lifetime. I'm Superintendent Trey Foles, and this is where we educate every child every day. Second quarter about to start off. Both coaches have to be pleased with that uh, first quarter in terms of defense. I don't know about the offensive end. They're probably, it's a mixed bag. Very happy with the girl, way the girls are playing on one end, not on the other. Another three right there. Covington's up 13-6. Fountain Blue slowly brings the ball up. Chauvin's on the ball, top of the tee. Nice little screen, being very patient, looking for the good, good shot. Ball swung out wide, Chauvin thought about it, puts it up, that's gonna be out on Covington, found Blue's ball. Good hustle by the ladies all around. Chauvin drives. Not there. Rebound, Lady Lions. Metal Lombard looking to push, push the attack a little bit. Singletary off the mark. Nice outlet. And a foul. Tell you what, Chauvin, she'll get, she's got guts. She'll get in there and uh, go against the larger players, taller players, no problem. Definitely uh, has some heart and shows it. And at the line, she is a marksman. Well, announcer's curse. Covington gets the rebound. Ball's pushed out wide. Lambert and a three-point play, at least an opportunity. Nice drive, foul on the play. Middle Lombard to the line. Getting three the hard way. And that definitely was the hard way. The kind iron right there for the Lady Lions. Got the bounce and the roll. Covington pressing in. Press pays off and a foul. Covington inbound the ball in the front court. Ball's in. Chastity Garrett looks to feed inside. McDowell off the mark. Looks like we have the ball tied up. Possession arrow is going to go the Lady Bulldogs way. Nice defense by the Lady Bulldogs. Chauvin bringing the ball up, looks. Covington ties it up. Oh, foul right there. He's, he's on top of it, a lot closer than I am, and I am wearing glasses. Put all that together, and <laughs> I'm not the guy to uh, dispute any calls.
Found Blue looking to uh, swing the ball. Covington playing some sticky defense inside. In and out for the Bulldogs. Covington's contesting just about everything put up. Ball's dropped back out, back in. Covington on the score. Lady Bulldogs pushing the ball up. Covington in a 2-3 zone. Really making life difficult in terms of finding uh, anything inside for the Lady Bulldogs. And we have a travel. Covington gets the turnover yet again. I tell you what, Covington's defense, quite impressive. And for that matter, Fountain Blue's defense has been impressive. But Covington has just kicked it up into a higher gear in terms of the defensive pressure. Ball's in and out. Fountain Blue with the rebound. Chauvin taking her time, serving. Gets it across midcourt. Swings the ball wide. Fountain Blue probing and probing, looking. Looking for any weaknesses in this uh, Covington back line. Not happening just yet. And on the sideline. Coach Bove is uh, saying she got pushed out. Doesn't matter, man, with the missile. The whistle says, uh, yep, it, <laughs> it's out of bounds. We're going the other way. Lady Bulldogs, see if they can uh, take advantage at this moment. So then looking, serving. Shot from three, off the mark. Covington with the ball again, going the other way. Lombard looks to press, finds Singletary. She drops it in. McDowell and one. Covington with another chance at the old-fashioned three. McDowell handles her business. Only a sophomore as well, so a bright future for that young lady. Chauvin looks. Nice move. And fills up the bucket. That is quality finishing right there, ladies and gents. Good stuff. Covington in the corner. Drops the ball down low, in and out. Drops it back in. And another opportunity for the old-fashioned three. Nice response from the Lady Lions. Excellent ball movement. Tell you what, when the ball does the work, it's hard to stop it. You could be Usain Bolt and you're not out running the ball. And the Lady Lions just did an excellent job of letting the ball do the work. Good stuff. Off the mark, though. No, no three this time. Found Blue pushes the uh, issue here. Covington taking away that uh, opportunity deep inside. Forcing the Lady Bulldogs into a, a three-point uh, game or a 15-foot jump shot range. Nice drive. Chauvin will uh, draw the foul. Steps to the line, finds, finds the range. Defense! 
And the second one's in and out. Covington pressing the issue again. Cassidy Garrett looks deep inside. Ball is stolen. Nice defense by the Lady Bulldogs. Chauvin looking to drive. Ball gets poked away, but she's quick. She is on it, recovers it quickly. Balls look outside, and there's a three. And it is quickly a 10-point game. And the steal and the foul, eight-point game. Bulldogs on a quick run, tightening his game up. Talk about a fantastic play by Chauvin right there. Heads up, very aware of what's going on. Pokes the ball out, old-fashioned three, and she nails it. And the lead shrunk down to seven. Bound Blue able to make a run, tightening the, the, the game up here a little bit. No surprise there, Coach Beeson, excellent coach, does a great job. Again, both coaches generally would be very happy with their defense at this stage. Travel on the Lady Lions. Chance for Fountain Blue to cut into the lead some more. Ball's outside in the corner. Looking to switch again. Chauvin surveying, scoping things out. Ball's dropped in, back out. 2-3 zone one more time by the Lions. Covington playing some sticky defense. Coach Bove and changes things up and then Definitely played out. Ball's played out off of Covington. Lady Bulldogs looking to push the issue, cut the lead. Chauvin's quick as a cat. Ball's in, off the mark. Lady Lions have it. Looking to switch, ball's out, in and out, just would not fall. <laughs> Melanie Dingman in for the Lady Bulldogs. Nice job on that defensive rebound. <clears throat> 25 seconds left. Looks like the Lady Bulldogs will hold for the last shot. Chauvin sits in the center circle. Just biding her time. Covington very content. Sitting back in a 1-3-1. And two seconds left. Long heave and it's way off the mark. Good half by both squads. Defensively, they're gonna go in and have some chalk talk at halftime. 23-16, Lady Lions. Covington to inbound the ball. Drops the ball in low. Looks in for an in and out game. Swings the ball wide. Not finding the mark right there. Covington's ball. Just back from halftime, I'm sure coach, the coaches had an opportunity to scope out the whiteboard. And I'm sure that's exactly what Coach Bove would have drawn up. Singletary from the corner. I'll tell you what, when she finds her range, she gets hot, she can fill up the bucket.
Fountain Blue still looking to drive inside. It's just it hadn't been there this evening, and they've had to uh, really put in a lot of work swinging the ball around the outside. If Fountain Blue can find the range on some of these outside jumpers, uh, don't be surprised to see Chauvin uh, have a little more space to drive. She's so quick on the ball that if uh, she just can find a seam, she can get in there for some easy, uncontested layups. But uh, they've got to find their range from the outside, and that just hasn't been the case tonight, at least not yet. Kira Brown looks to swing the ball. Singletary drops it in, out to Brown again. She eyeballs it up off the back rim. That's about the third time she's been a little strong. Chauvin drives and a foul. One of those moments where uh, she may have got a little too much body, but because she definitely got all ball. But that is one of those calls that uh, it's easy to see when she gets all ball. But again, you get too much of the body there, and that's exactly what's putting Miss Chauvin on the line. Good recovery by the Lions. Would have been an easy two. And still might be easy because, well, not quite there. Now well, that's a win for the defense provided they get the rebound here or still only give up a point. In layman's terms, that's a good foul. Found blue in that same 2-3 zone, forcing Covington to work in and out. They drop the ball in low, and they do get the foul. Off the front and back iron right there. Not happening. That one finds the mark. Another good foul right there. Would have been an easy two. Lady Bulldogs smartly uh, putting the player to the line. Looking deep. In. Nice roll. Kind irons right there. That's what you call the shooter's touch. Brings it back to a seven-point game. Singletary. Drops the ball off. Lombard looking to switch. Ball's dropped in. Off the back iron, too strong. Ball's tied up, and it's going to be possession for Fountain Blue. Good defense, Lady Bulldogs. Chance to cut into this seven-point Covington lead. Covington content. Hold the ball up. It's going to take some, some more of these uh, deep threes or uh, long range twos. Like that one right there, nice little 15 footer to get Covington out of this zone. Cuts the lead to five. Covington still looking to swing the ball. And a travel. Found Blue with a chance to cut the lead down to two or three. Get it back to a one possession game. Up, oh, steal for Covington. Nicely done, well read. Ball's dropped in, and we have a, a holding foul right there. Covington will inbound under the basket. Taylor Singletary to inbound. And a deep, deep inbound pass, and a travel. That was not a back 
court violation. That was a travel. Coach Bove has a timeout for the Lady Lions to talk some things over. Lady Bulldogs with the ball, inbounding. Chauvin on it. Looks to swing the ball. Again, probing, probing, looking for that opportunity to either drive or find a long range shot. Well defended by Covington right there. Lombard pushes the ball in the corner, back up to Lombard. She drives, goes inside. Nice ball movement by the Lady Lions. Chauvin and the Lady Bulldogs bring the ball up, swings it out. Again, looking, just patiently trying to find that shot. And the ball's out of bounds. Lady Lions with a, a, some good defense right there. Ball will be inbounded by Lombard. Covington into the front court, Singletary on the ball, drops it back out to Lombard, she drops it in McDowell, back out wide, nice ball movement again, and a foul. It'll be Covington's ball, taking it out under the goal, Singletary. Nice look, and in. Good stuff from Singletary and Lombard right there. Torgano inbounds the ball. Chauvin bringing it up. She looked, wasn't there. And nice shot, Angel Darby. That was a big three for the Lady Bulldogs. Something that was very well needed. And we have a foul. The question is, it's going to be on the Lady Bulldogs. Little Lombard driving the lane, using her quickness to her advantage. Makes the first one. And a second. Covington's leads back up to eight. Torgano on the ball, drops it over to Chauvin. Chauvin is very smart, very quick, just quality all around. And another three. Rebecca Janicki right there, finding the range, finding the mark. Two big threes, back-to-back -back possessions for the Lady Bulldogs. Covington looking to drive, does so, and gets the foul. Lombard, beautiful stroke right there. And another. Lombard in, inbound to, excuse me, um, Chauvin in, inbounds to Torgano. 
looking to find Torgano in the corner right there. Ball's played out. Torgano will inbound behind Chauvin. Chauvin looks, Torgano's on it. Janicki to Torgano and played out of bounds. Covington bringing the ball up, Metal Lombard. One of those senior leaders. Drops the ball in, and another nice shot. Chauvin for three, off the back iron. Covington with the rebound. And we have a reach in. It's going to be Covington's throw in underneath. Singletary getting a breather on the bench. McDowell will be doing the, the throw in, taking over those duties. She looks. Drive is there, and a foul. Covington has extended its lead to 10, looking to uh, work it to 11 here. Found Blue's been able to make a couple of nice runs, but uh, Covington's been able to respond both times. Leads up to 11, 38 to 27, 124 left. Third quarter. Chauvin looking, pushes the ball out wide, back to Chauvin. She eyeballs the rim, she thought about it. And the ball's tied up. It's gonna be Covington ball. Looks like Kiara Brown surprised Lombard right there with that pass. Lombard with the quick hands. Ball is dropped out, drop back into McDowell. She looks not quite there. And we have another jump ball. And this time it's going to be going Fountain Blue's way. Good defense by the Lady Bulldogs. Lady Bulldogs have stepped up on the defensive end or hit the big three when need be to keep this game close. Not that time, and it's going to be Covington's ball. Covington bringing the ball up. Going to take a quick shot. Nope. Pull the ball out. Looks like they're going to wait for the last shot here. No, they drive in and out, swing the ball, back out again. Nice patience by the Lions inside. And this time a jump ball again. It's Covington's ball and a jump ball. Ball will be taken out under the goal. Ten seconds left in the third quarter. Back in, McDowell, and the foul. McDowell will go to line with 6.7 left. Uh, back iron. Good foul by the Lady Bulldogs. Could have been an easy basket. Instead, McDowell's at the line. 
having to try to earn it the hard way. And does not. Turns out to be an excellent foul by the Lady Bulldogs. They push, push, push. Deep shot off the back iron. 38-27 into three. St. Tammany Parish Public Schools, an A-rated school district. Graduates with the highest ACT scores in the state. Facilities with the latest technology. Safe and secure schools. A variety of sports. Fine arts. And learning to last a lifetime. I'm Superintendent Trey Foles. And this is where we educate every child, every day. Found blue, inbounds the ball, Chauvin on it. Beginning of the fourth quarter, 38-27. Lady Bulldogs looking to cut into this lead. Stolen, but recovered by, oh, stolen again. Lady Lions driving and fouled. Covington's in the bonus. Two strokes from the charity stripe here. One down, one to go for the Lady Lions. And it's two. Lady Lions increase the lead to 13. Lady Bulldogs are going to have to push the issue. Chauvin swings it to Terragano. She drives, stops, resets. Chauvin looking. Swings it out. Well defended by the Lions. Find Chauvin. And she's fouled. She is so quick. Chauvin on the point again. Nicely defended by the Lions. They look to push. McDowell, not there. And it's going to be Fountain Blue's ball. Sydney Murray inbounds to Chauvin. Chauvin looks. She goes outside and a foul. Nope, I'm sorry, it's traveling. Covington inbounds the ball, metal on board bringing it up. Singletary drops the ball in, spin and in. Covington extends the lead to 15. And we have a timeout, Lady Bulldogs. Lady Bulldogs to inbound. Coach Beeson had a chance to talk to his young ladies, get them settled down, let them find their range. Like that right there. Just like he would have drawn it up. Found Blues had the, the, the knack tonight for hitting the big three to keep them... Uh, Right there within uh, scoring distance. We have a jump ball. Possession goes to Covington. Twice a night, these Lady Bulldogs have uh, made a run. Chauvin on the steal. Up and in. Uh, 
timeout. Covington. Covington to inbound, under the basket. Back into Singletary. She brings it up, crosses midcourt, checks up, drops the ball inside. The drive by McDowell, not there. Back up and in. Found blue. Chauvin on the ball. Looking, looking, pick set. Off the mark, Covington with the ball. Over, over the midcourt line, out to Singletary. Lombard's on the ball, tight defense. Three-pointer, off the mark. Chauvin looks to press. Pop and drop, not quite there. Covington with the ball. Game's getting a little stretched here. Bove, uh, Coach Bove has her uh, team slow it down. Ball's knocked out off of Covington. It's going to be Fountain Blue's ball. Chauvin bringing it up. 44-32, four and a half minutes to go. Corrigano with a drive, rebounded by McDowell. Covington pressing the issue. Pulls the ball back out wisely, but stolen. Angel Darby switches the point. And, well, I tell you what, that was uh, a lot of body uh, right there. So, uh, didn't, didn't quite play out. Referees or officials right there on the spot. <clears throat> Found blue, Lady Bulldogs. Get it to Chauvin, top of the arc, nope. Ball switched wide. Not there. It's going to be Found Blue's ball. Inbounded. Ball works to Chauvin. She looks, shakes, bakes, moves, distributes. Jill Darby distributes. Ball's being moved. A little stoppage in play here. Got a, a nosebleed. <laughs> Tough stuff for uh, the Lady Bulldogs here. Chauvin's out. Found Blue is going to have to go without their just talismatic point guard. She's, she's the one that a whole lot of their offense goes through. So it's going to be time for the Lady Bulldogs to step up. Ball stolen by Covington. Good hustle. Tied up. And it's going to be Lady Bulldogs ball. Possession arrow facing Fountain Blue's way. And down for the Lady Bulldogs. Jenna Chauvin running the point. She looks for a three. Not there. Ball's brought out by Covington.
Good work by McDowell underneath. To McDowell, and there it is. Inside game working right there. 46-32, Lady Bulldogs. Jenna Chauvin bringing it up. Jill Darby. Driven in, pushed back out, off the mark. McDowell with the rebound and a foul. She is tough underneath, cleaning up off the glass. Looks like Chauvin is uh, ready to check in on the far side. Dowell at the line, looking to extend the lead. Covington's in the bonus. Not there, unkind Ryan. Part of the game where you see some tired arms. She overcomes that. It's also the time of the game where it's make or break time at the charity stripe. So key to make those down the stretch. Covington with some pressure. Nicely done by Chastity Garrett. And Chauvin has to go back out again. Florgano subs in. Fonblue is going to have to go without Chauvin in these last couple of minutes, or at least until she can get situated. Tough luck for that young lady. It's a good thing she's got plenty more basketball in her future. Uh, it's my understanding she's going to be at the uh, Southeastern Lions. Ball gets tied up right there. It's going to be Covington ball. McDowell looks like she got a little finger in the eye. Singletary to inbound. She finds Lombard. Singletary gets it back. She finds Lombard again. Lombard was about to, to drive. Jenna Chauvin doing the smart thing there. Put her at the line, make her earn it. Fountain Blue has had the ability again to make these uh, really quick runs. And if they're going to do it, it's going to have to be uh, foul Covington. Put the Lady Lions on the stripe and see if they can earn it. Lombard earns the first one, but not the second. But McDowell gets the rebound, puts it back up. Lombard gets another bite, and she's going to be at the line again. Just one of those nights where I'm sure both coaches are pleased with the defensive effort. They have worked hard. They've made the, the opposition do everything in their power to find the bottom of the bucket. Lombard back at the line and drains it. It was a fortuitous opportunity for uh, the Lady Bulldogs right there. They were able to get Chauvin back in. She's on the ball, drives, shoots, scores, foul.
Chauvin at the line to complete, at least attempt to complete the old fashioned three. Not there, but boy did she work to get there off of Chauvin though. Quick as a cat, she is just lightning fast. Can't fault her effort. McDowell on the ball, slowly dribbles up, brings that up, picks up the speed, coast to coast, not there. Fountain Blue comes out with it and a foul. Fountain Blue inbounds. Off the mark right there by Chauvin. Nice hustle uh, by Sidney Murren to get the ball off of Covington. Ball's going to stay with the Lady Bulldogs. Murren to inbound. They swing the ball, drive, shoot, nothing. Nothing there. McDowell with another rebound into Singletary's hands. She drives, stops, and another foul. Bottom of the bucket, 51-34, Covington up. And the second one as well. Coach Bobe's got her young ladies really playing well from the foul line. Deep three, almost, not there, back out. Ball drops out again, Chauvin's on it. Chauvin's on it again. This time it's Jenna. She looks not there. Covington with the rebound. Taking her time, bringing up the ball slowly is Lombard. Three at the buzzer, but it's going to be Covington advancing in a hard-fought match. Two teams that uh, respect each other quite a bit. Two excellent uh, coaching staffs that got their girls ready to play tonight. Uh, thanks for watching. We'd like to thank uh, Dr. Uh, Schwang as well as our superintendent, Mr. Trey Foles, and all of uh, our St. Timothy School Parish School Board members. Good night, ladies and gents. Bye-bye.